All right, let's get started. We've had too much All time right. chatting, and yeah. Yeah. no one else is turning up. So, where you left yeah. off last week, this is a slightly different one, so I'll drop you on. Can, can we please yeah. stay huge this time? Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, for this time, I'll let you stay a little bit bigger. You know, nothing's to say these universes, these other islands came from, you know, have the same scale. We could be yeah. 20 feet tall to these guys. Yeah, you, I might ram you with a whole city that's only two feet across. <laughs> <laughs> and at that point, right, I step on it. <laughs> Although maybe I shouldn't use the phrase ram you with. Yeah. <laughs> in uh... fairness, that just means that the dinosaur is going to be in his element. <laughs> yes, I could be Mecha Godzilla. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that needs to happen. Yeah, yes. make it an area. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when you go to a model village as a kid and just feel like a giant. Yes, make a note of this, Gray. We're yeah. going to do it. We're going to do I it. I would be the sh- I would be the shortest <laughs> giant because I'm a dwarf. I'm so sad. <laughs> I feel like a normal person now. The world's shortest giant. No, I just feel like a normal person. Yeah. (laughs) It's like, you know, Victorian freak shows where they just have intricate wordplay. Bearded lady, the world's shortest giant. (laughs) Beardless man. The bearded lady is just a lady with a gay husband. (laughs) It's a rather (laughs) effeminate man. (laughs) Final Fantasy character, what? <laughs> all right. So let's see how this goes. We have to purge all the elves and then purge all the slaves. All the bad elves. And- to do list number one, create checklist. Number We're, two, well, <laughs> checklist. Number <laughs> three, you- purge elves. Considering what you guys did last time, I think you're kind of on the gray side of good of uh, bad elves. <laughs> so yes, yeah, purge all the elves. All right. They're going to respect our martial prowess and invite us to another feast. That's what I think. <laughs> like mistake <laughs> made. <laughs> <Think> <laughs> said, trust is gone now. We're fine. <laughs> <laughs> And then you're going to accept. We're going to go back in the slave pen. The first session is going to happen all over again. <laughs> Only this time without a dragonborn desperately trying to dash between the two groups of dying people. Yeah, I think the fact he had like 40 squares to go between the two was a bit much. Oh, that's what yeah. we need. Grid. Oh, yes. But if I put grid on, you're going to be massive. Just make well, us small. I, I well, can just, live with it. Oh, it can be small then. I have no problems with oh my... Oh, God, that's a tiny grid. You're a tiny grid. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can always just say that, that our size is our sphere of influence. Well, then I guess mine has to be the biggest, since I'm a dinosaur. I don't know how you build really lot of small arms. How do you influence much with your small arms? You never see a clothesline done by a T-Rex. <laughs> I don't need to, I can just kick them. <laughs> can we get like a fire effect on the one that's the barracks? Um, dee, 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 dee. Or just a like, letter F for either fire or fucked, <laughs> depending which there way. There we go. go. Oh, that was the barracks? Oh. Oh, that was the keep. The keep. Oh, yeah. Because why would you have the keep all the, the barracks all the way back there? Yeah. Like, yes, yeah, so let's put our soldiers like safely in the back so they don't get hurt keep the diplomats in front <laughs> there you go this would be better if I hadn't you know just spent two and a half hours driving this morning yeah, that's, that's always right. fun yeah I, I'm going to be I'm going to be driving 2000 plus miles soon I, I don't like driving 200 miles but yeah that's a difference in countryside isn't it <laughs> yeah Oops. well see mine because moving Halfway or all the way across the country is a long distance. I've done Surprisingly, that before, can you not just go on the train? They don't have trains in America. They do we have a couple of trains. Actually, do. I've seen the westerns. <laughs> actually, if you're if you go to Houston, I think that you can get you can get a train going. Uh, think... 
I, I don't think there's a train from Houston to Portland. Yeah. Our uh, trains are not like the Hogwarts trains. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> They may get you closer, though, so you can. Get vomited on but we, we still have to drive the, our vehicles there and get stuff there. Well, we've you all, can actually... We've already had this conversation, though. You don't have gearboxes on your cars. That's not counted as driving. <laughs> you may as well just put cruise control on, go in the back and hey, eat a salad. My bike has a gearbox. It's just that you don't actually have to move your hand to use it. Well, you do, don't you, to shift gears? Yeah. Is it shift with the yeah. left, accelerate with the right? You, you close your hand to engage the clutch, and then you use your left foot to shift. Ah, right, that's the one. It's been that a while since right. I've ridden a bike. Her name was Wait. Sarah. Are you going 2,000 miles across? Oh, go ahead. Right, right. No, back on game. Back on yes. game. Focus. <laughs> Stay on target. We're giving Serpentis and Trust time. We're buying them time with our inane conversation. I thought Serpentis was supposed to be gone today. If I remember correctly. I have no idea. I oh, well. pay attention to literally nothing that spews forth from his vacuous mouth. He does watch <laughs> these, you know. Mm-hmm. Hi, Serpentis. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wait, so, are we recording? Oh, yeah, we've been recording for a while now. <laughs> oh, this <Disney> Christ. <laughs> I mean, I love Serpentas and... Crop this part out. Golden throat. <laughs> no, no, this is all staying in. Uh, okay. gets and in other news, Grail has lost two hours of another video. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> um, all right. Right, so what are you going to do? You've got the elves pinned up in their burning barracks. We're going to go kill them. Yes. All right. What would we do? Let him burn. Zoom. Yep. Are there any elves in the other buildings? Uh, you'd have to have a look, wouldn't you? But All I'm right. going to say that there's going to be. Why a- don't we just burn them down? Because, because we, we kind of want to take this place. <laughs> we need some some yeah. infrastructure for after war. What's in this building right here? Uh, that's the food store. So take we it. don't so want to burn sure that down. I'm going to take a minute and check for elves in there. All right. If we see an elf chef, we got to keep him. Yes. We need to keep anyone who has skilled. Who's skilled. Yes. <laughs> we have um, no skill. He... <laughs> We're adventurers. We don't need skills. We need just the ability to go, you know, look at a thing. Murder. and We need the ability to be murder hobos. <laughs> Anything right here? Huh? That's kind of like um, an armory. Armory? All oh. Right. Lots, All of right. bows. Lots of bows and a few swords. Well, we don't. We can't see that from here. I mean, we got to go, like, roll perception and write. I mean, they may no, be we... magical items. Yeah, I think the first thing we need to do is handle the barrack situation. Yes, we should uh, handle that's the not, barracks. You're not going to just sit there forever and get bombarded by cannon. They might. They are elves. So... Who's the most I'm, diplomatic or intimidating of us? Which I assume usually would be trust, but aw, he's not here. Um, Surprisingly enough. I have a penalty to both of those, even though I'm a dinosaur. Um, I think Gators is slightly higher than mine for diplomacy. One sec. Let me bring negative up Negative one for diplomacy. All right. Well, I'll, I'm diplomacy uh, plus seven. Wow. I have minus one. So wait. No, wait. We're not going to have to let the elves do the talking for us. You know what happened last time? Come, Gator. We will roll our negatives. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to roll, then at least roll uh, Intimidate. I have a negative on that one, too. Well, I'm just going to say... Um, I screw up my diplomacy check. We can do this two ways. We can keep firing cannons. You guys can trickle out. We can kill you one by one. We can rush in and kill you. Or you guys could give up and live. So, your call. That's a rude line. And that's them. actually diplomacy because I don't want... I'm not very intimidating. Um, Oi, be- buds, you want to die? <laughs> that one's just kind of like, yeah... A white flag comes out. Well, it was a white flag. It's a bit smoldery now. Rawr. All right, ceasefire. Can we wave or something and get the airship to stop shooting? I'm, 
I'm not an intimidating dinosaur. <laughs> I talked to I talked to my gnome to gnome blight on my communication stone. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, let's let's let the the dinosaur and the dwarf look intimidating while we get these guys out as 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 in, as in as few numbers as possible at once, so they don't see how that there's only five of us. I will, <laughs> in a gesture of goodwill, uh, roll a heal to uh, cure like light burns and stuff, if that's possible. All right. Oh yeah, I'll also help see to um, people that are injured. I'm a dinosaur. Like they don't expect that from me. <laughs> you lick your lips and look at them. Yes. <laughs> All right. Wait, I'm a t- we don't have lips. I lick my fangs. And so, teeth and thing. Yeah. The two elves are now binding the surrendered elves, like burns <laughs> up and stuff, putting well, salves and ointments and unctions. I don't trust them. them. Well, we and should leave trust so and uh, the the yeah. paladin with these guys to guard them. Yes. And that way, they can't come along with us. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. The paladin who isn't actually here should be left with the prisoners. <laughs> thereby explaining in the fluff why he isn't actually here that is a yes. very good idea mm-hmm. yeah it works for me that is so well, if, he does like t- if he does turn up yeah, you're going to have to explain where, where the presents have come <laughs> and if he does we'll turn leave- up then he's going to have deja vu when he has to run 40 squares to join in with the action again <laughs> <laughs> and don't and we'll we, leave have to leave- trust- we have to put trust back into the barracks <laughs> Well, we're leaving trust serenading the, uh, the 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 guys from the barracks, so their inevitable betrayal will be a lot more justified. <laughs> their inevitable betrayal will be sent to catchy music. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, only be said to Guile. It's going to be set to Guile's theme. <laughs> Anything can be set to Guile's theme. <laughs> Focus direction yeah. now. Okay, so right. about five. Uh, about that's not the way I want to start the sentence. Five elves um, have seemed to have survived. Um, you know, the barracks has been shelled for a good long time now. Especially since <laughs> you took a short, uh, possibly extended rest before this. Um, <laughs> We're going to need a lot more cannonballs. <laughs> it, what is our ship using for cannonballs? Are we just using magical missiles, or are we just using yeah. uh, no magic or stone? Of course, stone, stone works just as well. All right. Potato, potato. Or corpses. Or corpses, yeah. So, something I'm not going to track, because I'm not tracking cannonballs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but I am disappointed in you, apparently. Yeah, I, I need all the cannonballs on the map. I don't know how I can play without cannonballs on the map, but that's okay. <laughs> this building here, do you see the one building above the burning barracks? That's full of cannonballs. <laughs> <laughs> Happy. It's full of respawning cannonballs. Yeah. It's got a cannonball like, so have, like a <laughs> building full, full of cannonballs, cannon. but no cannon. Yep. They're throwing returning cannonballs. <laughs> <laughs> These cannonballs. <laughs> so it's a building full of balls. Gotcha. So let's continue on. <laughs> ah, I can't write S. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid right. drawing tool. So what's this building over here? Which one? Uh, uh just to the, the left. one, the bigger the one of us. Yeah. No, don't minimize. <laughs> um, that's just going to be ah. general, like um, stores. All right. Which building has the magic items? Uh, that would be the key. Well, I guess well, we have to just, go explore the key. We're, we're having it's the to only check, important building. Well, we're having to check every building to make sure there's no elves let's, hiding yeah. in them. Let's sweep for... Yeah, can we do a perception to make sure yeah, we just do a look for people that are hiding? I thought that was going to say something else, but you were with an L instead of a T there. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> <laughs> All right, 20 and a 1. Yeah, which building has the sluts in it? <laughs> <laughs> the elves, any building that's got them in. Oh. <laughs> Which buildings are made of wood? All of All them, the elves. 
Right, so what's in that last building that hasn't been carefully and considerately labelled? Um, that would have been the stables, except it's empty at the, po at the moment. We don't That's need horses. I don't think any of us have the right skill. We need we need dinosaurs to ride. I'm going to stare at you. <laughs> oh no! Why? Thanks why write me. things? Why? <laughs> okay. I didn't actually. They got rid of ride in this one. Is it part of athletics? Uh, I guess you just generally they consider you able to ride a horse without falling off. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Riding lets you do stuff like add to your mount's speed and stuff and do maneuvers. Yeah, your own your mount stand, has like a thing. And stand on the mount while shooting arrows. You're a All dinosaur. Why do you want to think about doing that? You can't even pull a bow. <laughs> Technically he's not a dinosaur. Yeah, he I is. just look like a dinosaur. He just wants. He just thinks he's a dinosaur. Yes. However, Are I you... can't get a crossbow mounted to my shoulder. I have not seen him outside of his wild shape. Costly, the, the same guy. Have you so seen for him all you know, I room? am a dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So the keep. Yes, magic items. Let's go get them. <laughs> okay. So, so what is this? Futro. It's the Futro. Fuhrer, Fuhrer lives there. <laughs> <laughs> it's Ad Adolf Hitler, right? No, because this is a little outpost. Oh. oh. Does this oh, really well. look like the capital of an evil elf empire? <laughs> you never know. Elves. Any fucking place can be the capital of evil elf empire. They're all elves. So. so. <laughs> It's going to be the eagle's nest. This is the hardest thing to write with. <laughs> Are you I sure you're not just bad at it? Motherfucker. Is there a label tool? No. That sucks. Alright, continue on. What are we doing as we approach the bunker? It's not a bunker, it's a great big fort. It's like two, three levels tall. <laughs> and why didn't we shell it? Oh yeah. Oh, we'll commence shelling. <laughs> No, they've all surrendered, it's fine. That's meant to say, Fuhrer Bunker, <laughs> treasure. Yes, they surrender, <laughs> commence, ter commence shelling. <laughs> we don't have the paladin with us today, we can do what the fuck we want. Alright, Zukov, calm down. <laughs> Put the, the dads in the way now, it's time for us to play. What? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's continue. All right. I swear you to God, to if anyone deletes like, my painstaking labels, I will actually cry. <laughs> just the worst. I'm just going to change the map at some point and they're going to go. Get... <laughs> well, one, one second. I'll clear the grid and take a screenshot and I might be able to stick that on the actual bit image if that makes you happy. <laughs> that would make me very happy. <laughs> Thank you, dear, for your players. Grey DM is best DM. Yay. There you go. So, inside the... What are you rolling for? You've already done your diplomacy. If you're going to sneak into a bunker when they're opening the door for you... <laughs> I rolled my diplomacy to see if I could get the GM to keep all of my writing. <laughs> <laughs> you have a hard day. You come in and all you get is this. I was rolling to see if you wanted to do me a favor. I was playing by the rules. We're throwing him in the bronies room. <laughs> right. So, I'm going to see if I can get this to show up on yours. Uh, having 30 rounds, the first thing you find is a um, rather ornate banner, which is the end of the equivalent of the Great Hall. I'm going to eat it. Can we at least see what it looks like first? <laughs> this will be excellent kindling for our uh, engines. <laughs> if it's magical, it's got copyright in it, we can burn it. <laughs> uh, if it glows, we could burn it. <laughs> All right. 
Does anyone have detect magic? <laughs> what do you think we are, wizards? <laughs> I thought detect magic wasn't a thing. You just played around with it in your off time. <laughs> Sorry. No. <laughs> <laughs> my mind is in the gutter today. Yeah. <laughs> like a young boy discovering what ejaculate is, basically, is the same as how you find out what magical uh, items do. It depends We're on how you discover it. We're trying to keep this PG-13 as much as we can with Elf Ashlitz. No, we aren't. <laughs> Did you hear me say all of the stuff I said last episode? <laughs> Or did you mentally blank it out just as like a safety mechanism? Uh, all right. Well, we all break dance and draw on the map. Yeah. All right. So yeah, you... I wasn't drawing. I was labeling. I labeled too. I labeled the camp. So you basically find these two identif- uh, things. I don't know if that's just popped up for you anywhere or. Yeah. yeah, like we got yeah. a luck blade and a battle standard of healing. If it's a white oh. flag, it should go to one of the elves. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'll let you decide what it looks like. <laughs> oh, it? Uh, when it says uh, level three, is that the level you need to be to wield it? No, it's no, just, it's it's just... Uh, one of your level three items. Ah. Hmm. I know what it should look like. To MS Paint. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So well, it's basically just something you wrap around someone's wound. <laughs> just you know, a it's, it's a, this you know, is what it looks like. Whenever you or an ally spends a healing surge, and it makes a zone of healing, and you can spend a healing surge. That, that's uh, what zone, the one hit like. point. <laughs> so basically, this makes up a zone where you're just harder for you to kill. Uh, yeah. Wow! Everybody gets that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a, so it's a, it's a actually good we can yeah. we can mount that to my back. You have to plant it, so you have to kind of you know stab it in the ground for it to work. Yeah, but you cool. can. I think you can attach it to my back though. Not as a warforged. War forged. No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> you had to have Warforged force components to do that. So we steal their battle that. standard, and where's the where was the where was the sword found? Uh, the sword's found in the old uh, elf boss's um, like quarters, the fanciest quarters. I thought we already had to fight the elf boss, or is he or was he gone before the place disappeared? Uh, no, you fought him. He just wasn't carrying his fancy sword, or he was carrying the fancy sword, and you took it off his body, whichever you prefer. Sure. Uh, anyway, yeah, that that image I posted. That's what the battle standard of healing should look like. For those at home, he's just basically posted the symbol of corn. Yes. Corn, not corn. It's a big difference. <laughs> yeah. I think the you symbol of it corn. <laughs> vegetarian god of the damned. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a vegetarian, you're already damned, so. <laughs> All right. Okay, and let's see now. So we've basically taken this place now? Yeah, it's all yours. Mm-hmm. Yes, cool. we've taken it. Yay! Yeah, look, look at the lovely place you've got. We have a, we have a base of operation. It's a shame it's not a village of uh, halflings. Then we could have Tolkien it. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name of this outpost, by the way? We name it. New New Cybertron. New Cybertron. Strange <laughs> <laughs> ways. Oh, this, all right, I'm gonna go talk to Gnome Blight and let him know that we've taken the place and we've got a base of operations. Yeah, so he can land the ship. Well, not land the ship, but tie yeah, it off and let it tie it float. off. And so you've, mm-hmm. you've secured the area. Um, so, what do you want to do about the lazy bombs, as they're called? Uh, what are we going to do with the lazy bombs? Put the elves to mining and put the slaves to sleep. <sighs> do it. Sleep as in, like, rest, or <laughs> in the animal version. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess that's all up to you. <laughs> no, well, players. put it like this. They were somehow, in cap- they were somehow trapped in a, in, in a waist-high, you know, <laughs> fence around them, if I remember correctly from last session, because I jumped up there, you know, easily enough. 
Yeah. You're a hero, though. You know, they have a base 10. You know, they're useless. Uh, <laughs> all right, I'm going to cut my hands and shout, All right, you're free now. What the fuck do you want to do? Okay, so... Most of right, the ones just happened because I spent far too long making that ban. <laughs> Are we freeing slaves now? <laughs> They're not technically free, and the door's still closed. Right, so we're shouting at people still locked inside a camp that they're free. I'm on the wall. Oh, that's all right then. Yeah. Um, you can just walk through the gate, you know. <laughs> I'm not letting them out yet. We had to keep yeah. this controlled. At least let them finish their Dragonborn first. <laughs> <laughs> Dragonborn is expensive. <laughs> it's like crab. So, Once you get through the tough outer layer, the meat is delicious. Can we do a nature check? Is this a sustainable place at this point? Are we going to be able to grow enough food to, to feed yeah. five elves and... Ten prisoners or whatever. We can just grow corn. Ten prisoners. There's a lot of prisoners. There's about fifty of yeah. them. Yeah. Right. Just, I need just to go plant with a bunch of corn. I can't right, believe I, I rolled a seventeen. You rolled a seven, and you've still nearly outrolled. Ooh, it's like I'll eighteen roll. to twenty-three. All right. Uh, Bert <laughs> can lock himself <laughs> in an accountant's here. <laughs> The dinosaur actually set, accidentally sets the fields on fire. No, Ma Maverick knows there's no hope. There's no meat here. Yeah. <laughs> what he's doing in Relic's nature check is law of the jungle check, not really a nature check. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, after looking around, you think that, you know, you can probably last for a while with the crops are near harvesting. and That'll give you a few weeks of food, but, you know, it's not long-term sustainable. You'd need about ten times the amount of fields to feed the number of people you've got. So, this was a uh, nice adventure to get a couple of magic items. Let's fuck off. Well, all right. But everything's coming to us here, since this is the largest landmass that's drawing everything to it. Potentially largest. Well, the largest yes. we've run into so far. Uh -huh. Well, we know that our old island, like the one with the village and the cave with the dead dragon in, is heading in this direction as well. That will give us more sustainable, will give us more landmass to, you know, farm more with. with. Yeah. Yes. Well, if we want to farm, we need seeds. Wait, no, we must become the Irish. We have to farm potatoes. <laughs> we are not becoming the space Irish. <laughs> Well, Burgess locked himself in a room and is, you know, counting everything because he's now the record keeper. Alternatively, <laughs> we could become the Russian and have lots of vodka through the space potatoes. Why did you know appealing to the alcoholic with vodka would work? <laughs> <laughs> I jokingly call myself an alcoholic. I have got a can of Strongbow in my hand. <laughs> is there a way to inventory the, uh, the 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 slaves and find out who's uh, if, who's sane, who's insane, and who uh, can do what? Yeah, you can spend a, a day or two doing that. Uh, what you'll quickly find out is that there's pretty much two groups. Forty of. I'm just playing rock music in the matter, or not rock, but yeah. rock music. <laughs> <laughs> you darn kids with your rock music, dance music. <laughs> then that's the one I was after. <laughs> Um, Two groups of yeah. So the main group of forty, bit emaciated, pretty normal. The last group of ten seem to have gotten a taste for you know the flesh of the dead. Well, we have so, our garbage disposals. Yeah, you also have yep. about ten people who can now be considered ghouls on the island. You uh, say ghouls, I say shock troops. <laughs> if well, no ghouls are actually you know monsters. And you say this, monsters, this. I say shock troops. Meaning they yes. don't take orders that well. Well, they're not all You the say way orders, gone, I say put in a cage and kicked overboard. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have the materials to make cages, I don't think. Do we? We, we have, an we have a mine. mine literally there. Yeah. 
we, what they said it was mostly depleted. I think we have like two war ha- storehouses full of stone and, and iron. We can make yeah. a cage out of stone. Well, it's not dwarf fortress completely, is it? Well, we just <laughs> we it's not put until them in. we finish the mechanism for kicking slaves over. <laughs> but. <laughs> well, we obviously we just put the ghouls into the cave, have our own little dungeon. Yes, yeah, adventurers will come to us. Yes, we charge adventurers to go in to it, and then we, when they die, we take the loot off their corpses. Welcome to your Nazi-themed adventurer theme park. 